Hi everyone! Welcome to the AWS Game Tech Digital Download, our first ever online event for the game developer community. Today, AWS is bringing content that was initially created for the 2020 Game Developers Conference. GDC presents the game industry with an opportunity each year to come together as a community. But as plans changed, we wanted to make sure we were able to celebrate game developers and all that you have done and will do for the industry. This actually opened up a larger opportunity to connect to many more game developers all over the globe who were previously not making it out to San Francisco last March. Having trouble prioritizing sessions and demo content to see today or want to revisit content you really enjoyed? Great news! All content in the digital download will be available right here for the next six months. We will still be here tomorrow waiting to share everything we know about game development in an on-demand format. Kind of like the game Mist, except that we won't be stuck in a random book against our will. And if you are watching me right now, you're already one step ahead of your friends. Hopefully you will find the content helpful and we encourage you to share everything with your friends and invite them into the AWS community of game developers. Speaking of community, thank you for being there with each other as a community and allowing us to be there for you during this time and beyond as we navigate 2020. So stay with us as we discuss the most burning questions you have about AWS Game Tech and go over the features of the digital download platform, including the different types of sessions, demos, and experiences that are available. And moving right along to one of my favorite subjects, AWS Game Tech. Our first audience question comes from Nathan. When can I get an alpha key for Valorant? Well, Nathan, I can't help you with that, but I can educate you on what is AWS Game Tech. AWS Game Tech is a cheat code that you will find for the best game technologies for game developers from AWS. From servers to databases to the largest evolution of technologies like artificial intelligence and machine learning. We are, we are an AWS team dedicated to serving game developers all around the world. Many of us have a background in games. Some of us even have served as leaders in several game developer communities, and we all have a deeply rooted passion for this industry. We think every one of you are super cool Fonzies, and we can't wait to talk to you next about what you are creating. Now, the next thing you might be thinking, besides wondering if the price of your turnips will go up this afternoon, is why AWS Game Tech? And the answer to your first thought about turnips is no. It's always no. Why do I keep on investing in the stock market? The answer to your second question is actually way less disheartening. With 175 plus services and 14 years of proven expertise, AWS has everything you need to build faster, operate smarter, and delight your players. AWS has services that are specific to game development, such as Amazon GameLift for session-based multiplayer hosting and Amazon Lumberyard, a free and robust cross-platform game engine. But game development use cases are as unique as the characters in your games, and they are often not one size fits all. Having many options is an extremely beautiful thing. And with a wide portfolio of services, there's a lot of room to play and bring to life what you want to develop right now and also into the future. From platformer leaderboards to dungeon crawler instances or economy building in an MMO or matchmaking in an auto battler, there are endless possibilities for every type of connected game that you're wanting to build. You'll see this exemplified in the different workloads and unique use cases using Amazon Web Services discussed today during the digital download. There are a few sessions and demos that are extremely great starting points if you are new to AWS or if you wanted to expand, experiment, and discover creative architectures from all around the game developer community. In the session, Introduction to AWS for Game Development, Daniel Whitehead and Peter Chapman will introduce game development, AWS resources fit for any size studio, and discuss different use cases that, have been hearing in the, that we have been hearing in the game developer community. Another session I am extremely partial to, Engage, Retain, and Delight Players with Live Ops on AWS, you can join Chris Finch and I as we pinpoint the right time to start planning for Live Ops in your game. Chris and I break down the game development cycle into a flywheel, and we go into each section with different use cases that we have seen across the game industry and how we can try on AWS. It's extremely easy for us to talk about this stuff all day, but we have also invited members of the AWS Game Tech community to share their experiences with building their games in the cloud as well. You can catch those conversations in the hands-on demo section and also in the How It's Built learning track. 
We tend to talk a lot about game development cycles and how they revolve around your player community's journey. In some cases, the priority for studios isn't about how many options are available to give those players those unique experiences on that journey, but more so about making sure that the experience that the players have is a reliable and consistent one. With more types and sizes of compute instances than anyone, AWS continues to be the industry standard for game servers, security, and performance. The best way of seeing the performance of AWS is through our customers telling their story and sharing the broad use cases with the game developer community. During the digital download, you'll find presentations, Q&A, and even under the hood demos from Ubisoft, Epic Games, Supercell, Gearbox Software, and many more. You will also have the unique opportunity to talk to these developers if you are joining us live. So don't miss out on the opportunity to ask all those questions and to say hello. In the session, AI Dungeons serving a five gigabyte machine, machine learning model for 400,000 players. Join myself and the creators of the, of the game AI Dungeon as we show the capabilities of the AI model that they created and watch their game grow from a hackathon project into a game with a player base well over what was in the name of the session. This is a good one not to miss because we dive deep into the architecture of their backend and also how AWS plays with other open source applications. Also, we are just as entertaining as we are informative and do a round of the game. Spoilers, I'm a wizard named Sir Barrington and come across a bunch of suspicious looking ruins. You have to join to find out what happens next. In another session, come join Gearbox Software, the Shift Services team, as they discuss the release of Borderlands 3 and the work going into preparing their infrastructure and teams for the launch. Speaking of preparedness, another way that we think we are ahead of the curve in helping game developers launch their games is the alien technology of tomorrow that we keep up with. Whether it's ultra low latency applications for 5G devices or procedural speech for NPCs, we're obsessed with inventing what's next for your players. I never thought that artificial intelligence could be used as a core mechanic in a game until somebody showed me that they built it and then that we were able to power it. We are so excited to see what you can build and keep up with the pace and give legs to all of your creative endeavors. In the technical inspiration learning track, you can join our team during the session, build and deploy games faster with CICD pipelines. There you will see how game development cycles of games are impacted by the continuous integration and continuous deployment model and learn which AWS services offer the best support for building out those updates and game changes quickly. Or in the words of GLaDOS, Speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. I have literally been waiting to fit that, in, that quote into this presentation somewhere, and I, I am extremely proud because it is a very apt description of CICD. The growing community of game developers who have worked with us to create powerful experiences for their players is what brings us here today to showcase the possibilities of what you can do with AWS. Here's a short clip of that community and the way that they exemplify how beyond great games, there's game tech.
Now jumping back to our main event, the AWS GameTech Digital Download. I know I have talked a lot about the pieces of the event, but let's talk about the different areas to help you navigate the digital download. The event is broken down into five different areas of content for you to explore. We've got 11 sessions across three categories, fundamentals, technical inspiration, and how it's built. Content is organized to provide the flexibility to mix and match sessions. On top of the sessions where you can see AWS Game Tech customers present, you will also be able to dive deeper into the technology details in the hands-on demos section. Here we will have a high level 101 demos where the technical details are your loot for the taking. We also have innovation demos where experimental technology of the game industry of tomorrow it will be displayed. And finally, under the hood customer architectures, where you can see how AWS has powered some of the coolest games to hit PC, consoles, and mobile last year. During the live event happening today, May 20th, you are able to chat with AWS experts and other members of the game developer community. In the Ask the Experts section, you'll be connected to AWS solution architects and game tech experts to ask them all the questions you can think of that relate to game development on AWS. Remember to use the chat to connect an AWS subject matter expert as much as possible. For those of you on On Demand, as it turns out, after today, the content will no longer have the chat function during the On Demand format. And last, but certainly not least, the Community Corner. Here, we highlight different ways of getting involved in the AWS game developer community and showcase member content that they have created from the different communities that they represent. Don't forget to check out the resources area. Here you can access AWS training and certification materials and where you can choose your own courses from the Game Tech learning path and more. There's a lot of content to go through. And again, you can come back to access the platform after you register. So make sure you see all of it. As always, we want to hear your thoughts and feedback, what you like, and we wanna hear if something helped you, and of course, what we can improve. We'd love to hear from you, and you can email me directly at gravesta at amazon.com. Follow us on social media at AWS Game Tech and use the hashtag AWS Digital Download to share what you learn. A lot of love across AWS went into making this event happen, and we are excited to be here to present it to you in this digital format. Our industry is growing at an unprecedented pace, and we are thankful that we get to ride this wild ride with friends. Enjoy the digital download and I'll see you at the closing.